Hey everyone, this is Ronan Day, and this is Molly. No, oh, she's camera shy. Coming at you from Tennessee, where today, August 21st, 2017, hello Molly, I saw a total eclipse of the sun. I keep wanting to say heart, because that song. <laughs> yeah, it was really, uh, really... Uh, well, words fail to describe exactly how it was. It's just something you really have to experience a total eclipse of the heart to uh, really, really appreciate it. I thought I had seen it all in like movies, TV shows, and whatnot, but to actually be there and when darkness falls over the land is definitely a very almost primordial feeling. One of the places where the total eclipse was happening was in Nashville, Tennessee. And I went to Centennial Park, where they have a reconstruction of the Athens Parthenon. Where we were at, it only, I think it was about a minute and 57 seconds was the totality of where we were at. Further north of us, it was uh, longer, two and a half minutes, I believe. Still, it was incredible thing to watch. Everyone got wild and crazy as the uh, moon went over the sun. And there was like this weird kind of, I don't know, like halo effect that uh, uh, happened when it when it occurred and it did feel very almost like a it felt like a movie in a way like it didn't seem real this uh this thing happening So what, what happened here? Um, we got engaged. Oh, wow. <laughs> yep. Uh, yep, all the way from Jersey and uh, Pennsylvania to here. Oh, wow. Been planning this for two years. <laughs> so what did you think of the eclipse? It was, it was a once-in-a-lifetime opportunity, <laughs> and that's and why I had to. Yes. <laughs> did you know that was coming? No. <laughs> 
In fact, I didn't even know this was coming. I didn't know about it until we got down here. She didn't oh, you just decided to come to Nashville because why not come to Nashville? Yeah. Oh, okay. Ah. I'm thinking she, we're I told wow. her we were coming here for our anniversary, which was about two weeks ago. Ah, okay. I told her this was the only time I could book the hotel. Yeah. We've been together for four years. Wow. All right. Well, congratulations. Thank you so much. <laughs> Get this guy? Yeah. Yeah. So, so did he act up any during the... Uh... Um, during the clips? No, he slept right on through it. Huh. Yeah, completely calm and, and chill and... So much for that myth. how he is. <laughs> anyway, yeah. What kind of service dog is he? Uh, he is technically an um, emotional support animal. Ah, okay. Because he is in training, though, currently for... Um, I have diabetes, so mm -hmm. he can actually um, assist me with that. Wait, he can actually hold the needles? Gosh, no, 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 I thought, no, wow, no. that's an incredible no, dog. No, like, seizures and stuff oh, with Oh, I see, um, yeah, yeah, yeah. And, um, you know, yeah. passing out with my blood sugar levels. So Ooh, yeah. He can actually warn me early on before mm -hmm. it happens. <laughs> he's just chill. Yeah. He's so what did you think of the eclipse? Um, it was amazing, absolutely <laughs> amazing. Yeah, most spectacular thing I've ever experienced, yes. And where are you from originally? Um, Valdosta down in the South Georgia area. Oh, okay. Yeah. Yeah. So you came up here for this then? Yes, just for, well, this and the Parthenon, of course. Yeah. What did you think of the eclipse? Oh, I thought it was awesome. I've never seen anything like it. So. And where are you from? Um, we're, the group is from Mandeville, Louisiana. Ah, okay. Yes. So you guys drove all the way up there for this? Well, we actually came up here for a, uh, there's a Renaissance Festival in Memphis, Mid-South Renaissance Festival, and we figured since we were so close, we might as well just drive up to Nashville and, yeah. you know, see the eclipse right. right here in the grand scheme of things. <laughs> And what do you think about this uh, Parthenon setting that we have here? Well, I really love it. I would love to see the inside, but uh, <laughs> I mean, out on the outside so far, it's super impressive. I really like it. Well, like I said, it's uh, you know I know Greece has the original Parthenon, mm. but Nashville's Parthenon, ours ain't broke. <laughs> Very good point. <laughs> Although I doubt that theirs was made of concrete. <laughs> <laughs> true. Well, if it had been, it'd probably still be around. Very true. <laughs> But what did you think like when it all went dark? Is that the first time to experience a solar eclipse? Yes, <laughs> absolutely. And it was a little weird. I mean, I loved it, but there was like that small part of, you know, my, my mom calls it my lizard brain, where you're like, oh my God, this isn't, this isn't supposed to be happening. So, it was pretty cool. I thought it was pretty spectacular. It's the mm. first total eclipse in my lifetime. Mm. So, uh, <laughs> so uh, yeah, it was, it was a lot of fun. Yeah. Played, uh, we played during the eclipse just for us. Mm. Um, we figured what the hell, if people mm. don't like it, they can tell us after the eclipse yeah. is done. But uh, but they liked it. So uh, yeah. as we were walking to come and see the Parthenon, uh, a couple of other people said, hey, play us a tune. <laughs> Bagpipers can't resist playing when somebody <laughs> wants us to play. And then darkness descended, and you could, you could feel the temperature actually drop for that short amount of time. If you've never seen a total eclipse in your life, it is definitely worth checking out. Anyway, this is Ronan Dave. See you.